states at no point was there a risk to the supply of PPE um, to the frontline services in Scotland. Uh, there were 45 million items of PPE in the stockpile at the start of the crisis, and we have dis supplied over 200 million items of PPE to frontline services in, uh, through the course of uh, since the 1st of March. And we've, at the current situation, got uh, 118 million items of PPE in the central warehouse, in addition to stocks in hospitals, care home, and elsewhere. So it's absolutely not the case, for the record, that at uh, any point there was a risk of us running out of uh, running out of stock. Um, in terms of an industrial strategy, I mean, I've read uh, Labour's um, so-called industrial strategy document. Uh, it's pretty thin and pretty weak. Um, that is a slogan. That's a sound bite. This is us actually delivering an industrial strategy where it matters on the ground, working with businesses and others to actually make it happen in reality. And in terms of um, the response to businesses, um, I, I said in our statement, our focus was very, very clear and very, very blunt. It was to access highest quality, highest volume of product to the right specifications in the fastest possible time and get that to the front line. And I don't think anybody in the front line services, anybody in this parliament or anybody across Scotland would say that our priority should have been different from that. In that consequence, we focused on the businesses that could deliver the volume as, uh, as required to meet those specifications. We have gone through every single offer of help. More than 2,000 have responded to them. But as I said, as you would expect, our priority has been on identifying the ones that could actually do the business and deliver.